Alright, hi YouTube, this is the Presidential Tourist back with another video. And what I'm doing is, uh, McDonald's came out with two new versions of the Big Mac. You have the Mac Jr. And of course I got the regular Big Mac. And the Grand Mac. I wanted to um, basically try all three, show them to you, let you know what I think. With regard to taste, the taste, well, if you have a Big Mac, Basically, you know what it tastes like, so I'm not going to get too much into that. But I especially want to show you um, size and size comparison. You got the smaller, the regular, and the large. Now, I thought this was going to start in January. That's why I thought I read, but it just recently started, so that's why I wanted to get going on this. The Grand Mac, Big Mac cost me $4.99. That sandwich had five dollars. Woo, expensive. I only got it this time for this video. I'm not going to pay that much again. This is too expensive for a hamburger. Of course, the regular Big Mac is also very expensive, I think. $4.19. So, and then, um, let's see, the Mac Jr. is $2.39. Now, I don't even get Big Macs much anymore, except uh, when they have a coupon, I like buy them going free. Just four something for that is just way too much. Anyways, I got them. I want to show you to them. Show you them all. And um, you can let me know what you think. So, let's start by getting these uh, these three bad boys on a, on a tray. Alright, before we put them on a tray, I'll, I'll, I'll show it to you, um, each of them, as I put it on the tray. Here first is the Mac Jr. It's basically about the size of like a McDouble. In a way, basically all they took out was like the middle patty, or the middle bread and then one of the meat patties, but here it is. This is the Mac Jr. This is just a regular smaller hamburger. I don't want to miss any of that tasty lettuce. I actually do like the lettuce. Regular Big Mac. Oh, of course, everyone, well, not everyone. I know they recently done a study, and a lot of the younger people, a lot of the millennials, never even had a Big Mac, and some didn't even know what it was. Basically, Big Mac has three buns, uh, what is it, two patties, lettuce, pickles, cheese, and the special um, Big Mac sauce, which for a long time the ingredients was secret, but you can actually find the recipe for it on um, the internet. It's actually a pretty good sauce. I know I like to add mayonnaise to my hamburgers, but that sauce that's on it, no need. All right, now, the Big Man, the Grand Big Mac. Ooh. Whoa, now look at that. That is, that is big. This is probably what I, this is probably the size of what a Big Mac used to be years ago. They're all smaller now. Yeah, I put it next to that. And then uh whoops, whoops. Now you see the size comparison. And well, I guess, um, here, let me try a bite of each, let you know how it is. Like I said, if you had a Big Mac, then you know what this tastes like, because they're all going to taste the same. All right. Yeah. It has that same Big Mac flavor. They don't taste the pickles and the cheese and that sauce. Mmm. I always really like the Big Mac sauce. You know, I really should get them copy the ingredients uh, online to make it. That's what it looks like, the first one. And here, of course, same thing, but extra patty and extra slice of bread. That's what it looks like. And now, the, bad, the big boy. It's actually quite a big hamburger. Good size, um, decently heavy too. Basically it's a Big Mac and steroids. It has made the bread and the uh, meat bigger. Of course, see the sauce. Oh. 
Oh boy. There you go. And it's just like a regular Big Mac. It's more juicier, but there's more to it. Now I think this is a great idea of um, McDonald's to do, but like I said, you know that's a good sized hamburger. Five dollars is a lot for that, and you don't get nothing else with it. No drink, no fries. I mean, if you'd go to a regular sit-down restaurant, a few more dollars you can get a full meal for that price. So, to me, while I like it, I won't be buying that again. And like I said, I hardly ever buy Big Macs anymore because four nineteen is a lot for a hamburger. And this, mm, I mean, what did I, what did I say? Two thirty nine. I suppose that's not bad, but um, still, I mean, McDonald's is still decently cheap, I guess, compared to some other places, but some of the prices or some of their stuff has gone up, and it's just not worth it. It's just too expensive. Like I said, I'd rather go to a regular um, sit-down restaurant. Zoom in there so you can see better. That's pretty much it. I wanted to show you the size comparison of the three um, Big Macs. And um, who knows, maybe you might uh, be interested in trying because of this video. If you do, uh, please let me know. I'm always, in, I'm always interested in hearing other people's opinion. And I don't hear too much from you guys on uh, some of the stuff you do try. So if you get a chance, please let me know. I really do want to know what you guys think and gals think of some of these things that I show. Some of these food reviews. Alright, that's pretty much it. Uh, if you have any comments or questions, please put them below. I'm always happy to answer your questions, and I look forward to talking to you again soon, YouTube. Bye, everybody. Bye.